Hey friends, how you doing? Another video, I'm just doing my chores here. See, got my uh, chicken feed in there. It's mostly this 16% layer pellet. Um, I got some Purina scratch grains. I will say that I like uh, the do more scratch grains better. You get more, better price, and uh, a better variety. Not doing uh, a little bit of threw in just a little bit of uh, some grit for him. I'm using the oyster shells. Oh, man. So let's go see. Hey, girls. There's my dog doing her loops. What you doing, girls? Yeah. Yeah. As soon as this weather gets a little warmer, I'm gonna. Redo that bottom of the chicken coop. Ugh. All right. You can see that my chicken coop uh, roof. Seen better days. I'm not a roofer. Ugh. All right. Let's see. Well, that's what I got there. That real dirty egg right there is the fake one. It's another fake one right here. Boop. I mean, I got one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll get those out in a little bit. I don't have my containers on me so I get about six eggs a day more than feed my family of three and share uh, with the in-laws too so we six chickens will definitely take care of six people all right so girls how you doing I think I want to come out watch out come on oh let's check this all right, so I don't know if you can see. Uh, water's coming out the nibble. All right, so they're good. Give it a little shake. It's going to need change by tomorrow. How are they eating? Oh, they are eating. You are eating good, girls. Eating good. I'm really hoping that. I know he is. It'd be foolish to think otherwise that that chipmunk that I just cannot catch. Be foolish to think otherwise, but I'm trying to get that chipmunk uh, caught. But oh, they're vectors of disease. Apparently, they they're a vector of uh, Lyme disease and carry ticks. And I don't want that. I would love for that little chipmunk critter. Oh, let's show you what I'm doing. All right. All right. I'm gonna fill them up a little more because they're eating more the last couple of days. How's it going, girls? Huh? You enjoying it? You enjoying it? Oh, yes, they are. All right. Come along with me and we'll, we'll get some more uh, pellets. I switched to pellets. I used to get crumble. Um, but the crumble has been very, very, very powdery. And, you know, I, I guess it depends on what part of the lot you get because if it's early on maybe get more or less powder ugh, than when it's not but so I'm going to switch to uh, pellets get less powder I think I did put just a tiny bit too much uh, food grade diametaceous earth in there but uh, yeah so it's a little powdery because of that Oh. All right. Hi, girls. All right, some of that powder is actual powder, too. But, um, well, as I've been throwing in grass clippings and throwing in um, some hay bales, I'm sorry, girls. Um, you can see here. Um, you can't even see the um, the uh, wood underneath. It's there's a good four or five inches worth of dirt and compost that's come up just through feeding them. Hi, girls. So I'm gonna um, clean that out because one, they deserve to have a nice cleaned out coop, and two. 
Let me get this this way. Um, two, uh, I want that good old compost. You know what I mean? Hey, girls. How you doing? Is that rusty right there? Yeah. Spots to the uh, closest to us to the right. Well, she used to be. Now she just turned all the way around. Um, Hefe is all the way to the right. Rusty is the... These fingers. Here's Rusty. This is Pepper. This is uh, Hefe. Because I... I wasn't for sure if Hefe was a uh, boy or girl. Um, what did I say? Over here is Spot. And here is Mrs. Cluckers. And then we have Rosa over there. So Hefe and Rosa are the Rhode Island Reds. And the other ones are like a hybrid of a California White crossed with something else. I'm not sure. Don't remember. Um, I wanted all Rhode Island Reds, but yeah. at the time, that's all they had in terms of the layers. They're eating good. Um, they're eating good. So I got that five-gallon bucket design where you just put the uh, nipples in the bottom. You know, we're going to check the water anyway. It's it's too low. Pretty good design. I have a... Uh, uh, sorry, I'm shaking you there, bunch. I have a gamma lid. Watch out. Watch out, girls. On top. I uh, shouldn't have used a gamma lid. It was a waste. She used it for food storage. And I just peeked down in there. And uh, it's going to be good one more day. But uh, it's going to need some straight-up cleaning out tomorrow. Um, really good. So... Um, I would have to change that water every single day whenever I use the little hanging bucket. But this, um, much, much better. Love it. Can't believe I waited so long. It's saving a lot of time, a lot of labor. They are maintaining cleaner water and just better stewardship all the way around. So, um, the inside the coop, show you oh, what's going on here. One handed work. All right. And uh, yeah, they, they need some stirring around of the uh, of the bedding. Uh, they like to sleep up there. That's their favorite place. These roosts, uh, they they'll use that far roost over there. They don't like using the roost closest to the um, door. Hi. Um, I don't know if it's because of the temperature or because I don't close the door at night. It's gonna do pretty good to keep them critters out except that stupid chipmunk um, watch out Coco watch out girl I'm gonna get your head hit watch out um, coyotes have been spotted in the neighborhood so we're worried about those for now uh -oh. what's going on here I can't get these shut I have to Wait a minute while I do this. Oh man. You know when you're you're building a chicken coop? Um, as it rains and moisture gets on things, things are gonna flex and swell. I'm not a construction worker. I don't have a lot of uh, building skills. Um, I'm stubborn enough to if I want to do something, I'll do it. I think I showed you this before, not sure. You know, there's a ledge over here. I can get my shoulder out of the way. And over here, where the um, there's a pad in front of the garage, a little ramp in front of the garage, where it is uh, a little low. So I just put all my chicken shavings over there, and I think I'll keep on doing that. Um, because I don't have a proper compost pile. I need a proper compost pile. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's it for today. I am, uh, just resting. I did this just to make sure my chickens are taken care of. And I'm just going to enjoy this, uh, high Sabbath feast of unleavened bread. And, you know, just bask in tomorrow, uh, the first fruits of, you know, Jesus Christ. <sighs> Very blessed, very blessed. And if you like this stuff, like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate it. If you want to ring the bell to get notified, if you're down like that, that'd be cool too. Appreciate it.
appreciate everybody who uh, watches my videos. Um, just, just a dude trying the best I can with what I got. Love to hear your comments, questions, um, advice, all that good stuff. Appreciate it. Take care, guys.